Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Coming here with another episode of State of Decay Break, where we test the limits of our community as well as my mind. All right, we yet. left off. We had a... Uh, oh, you know, stuff. Well, just gotten all of that. All of that stuff. Uh, we got Dante's supplies that he dropped. And uh, I killed all of those Zeds. But also, I'm out of supplies because I was killing all of those Zeds. <laughs> So, um, have to grab a whole new set of stuff, uh, because I, uh, went through all of it. Every single bit of it. Why is no one at... Why is no one killing that bloater? Should be someone at the guard tower killing that fucking bloater. And the bloater's over here. Okay, well. That's a thing. That no one's doing. Come on, guard tower. Someone's supposed to be working there today, isn't there? God damn it. Alright, well. I'll just run over here, I guess. Try to lead him away from at least the house. Alright, well. Yeah. <laughs> I went through all my medicine, went food. through all my food. Just, uh blasted right through it and that's how that went <sighs> but they're dead they're dead and I'm happy because those that was the exact same setup too of fucking Zeds that took out Dante it was a bloater actually two bloaters uh, about two screamers two fat bastards and about a couple dozen you know regular zeds and i took them all out and i'm happy i'm happy now because they're dead <laughs> they're dead and i am not and that is a good thing all right um fucking take one of these fucking actually i meant to use it not take it but that works too <laughs> that works fine too all right <sighs> now might as well have one of these in the back pocket. And then reload the gun with all my ammo. Uh, reload. There we go. And then we'll sell the rest of the stuff. Yeah. Works out relatively fine. Uh, we should probably help with that melancholy, though. That sadness. With, uh... Alice, hey. let's go for a walk. Come on, quit moping around. I need your help. I can do that. All right. Come on, Alice. I know we're all sad about Dante, but we need to move forward. And I'm able to move forward now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I'm still kind of sad about it, but... I have my coffee, which uh, was very necessary. Keep myself uh, from losing my mind. Wow. Just absolutely moited. Love it. All right. I guess we're going over here then. All right. That's fine. You holding up okay? Well, I'm not exactly seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. I Seems don't like blame you. hit you especially hard. Yeah. Could we not do this right now? Please. Uh, we kind of need to do it right now, Alice. I know you don't want to, but we kind of need to. Ah, man. Yep. These are all Zeds I killed. Yep, yep, yep. Why are we going all the way here? Jesus. Going past... Well, I mean, we could sell him... We can sell them some of our stuff. Why not? There we go. Alright, let's sell you this, this, all of that. That and that. That's just fine. And you got plenty of guns and other weapons. Maybe we should start selling to the other guys. <laughs> they probably need some. A little bit. Alright. Here we go. Up. We got zombie. Okay, 
Yep, we're gonna I go can see. Some zombies the old <laughs> yeah. Wow, you have a two by four. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna have to do that thing that fucking Adele was talking about. Because, <laughs> Jesus. Oh, my gosh, my people are equipped with the worst weapons. Really? Yep, that they are. And that's the ones I really care about. Whoops. That didn't hurt you, did it? I don't think I can do hurt against people. But at the same time, I was worried, like, oh, geez. That was a little too close. Now I'm not sure. Oh, hi there. Oh, boy. There we go. There's that. And murder. Moida. Ooh. You deadly. You deadly good. What? What? There's someone in there? Garbani! What the hell are you doing in here? Garbani, the fuck? The fuck, girl? What the hell are you doing in here? Your legs are gone. And let's take out you. Oh, dear. Fuck off. Let's kill you. There we are. Let's put on that machine suppressor and make things a whole lot easier. There we go. Okay, and... Whoop. There goes your legs. Oh, fuck off with you. Oh, fuck off. Oh, shit. Well, at least it wasn't me that got hit with it. Still bad that it's Alice, but, I mean... At least they know what's out there. Alright, whoop. Jeez. There we go. Break it, fucking... This make you feel any better? Well, I hope so. After all of that... I'm ready. There we go. Good stuff. Also, why the fuck was Garbani in here? She's doing a mission or something, isn't she? God damn it, of course she is. We're clear. What the hell is in here? Ooh. Medicine, maybe? No, of course not. That'd be fortunate. Why did I expect anything fortunate? It's, it's me. Okay, let's just fucking get in this thing. This gaudy looking thing. I'm, I'm not a fan of carbon fiber. Carbon fiber or anything. Spoilers that high are a little goofy to me. Stripes are nice. But everything else is just kind of bleh. Unnecessary. Did you want mind. anything else? But if you keep that shit inside, it'll move away at you. You've got to let it go. Thanks. Alrighty. That was weird. It was like half of that wasn't mentioned. Alright, well. It's true. If you let it stay inside you, it'd just eat you up. I appreciate your concern. It means a lot to me. Good. Thanks. I'm glad you see it my way. Alright. My weapon now needs a repair. There we go. And there we are. Good. And let's reload it the rest of the way. And get an extra one. And we're good. Good shit. Okay. Alrighty. Since we have a lot of fucking... <laughs> a lot of fucking stuff at this point. Yeesh. Let's uh, do a couple missions. Let's get people's trusts up, huh? Trusts. Get the trust of other people hey, up. That's what I should be again. saying. A map again? What? Is there another thing? Oh, there's a scavenger here. Let's go with a stranger in trouble. I'm Maybe it's someone out. we know. Maybe it's not. Come and let that heal. Let someone else handle things for a while. No. No, not gonna let that happen. This is this is the injuries I sustained trying to help Dante and fail. I deserve to sit with them for a little while. At least until the end of this recording session. It'll be a reminder of what it means to do everything and still come up with nothing. Jeez. 
That was quite a stop I did. Alright. What the hell? Wow. There we go. What the hell? What are you doing out here? I don't even know who you are. Whoa. Got two of you. Glad you stopped by. Fact is, we're never gonna make it on our own. Not like you folks have. Um I'm lucky they didn't hear that. Yeah, yeah, we are. Oh, Sit please tight. be fuel. Please be home. fuel I can use. We'll oh, back. thank you, merciful Jesus. <laughs> thank you. Allah. Thank you, Shiva. Oh, thank you. Oh my god. You know oh, hey. those first few days. I thought it wouldn't be too bad. Just avoid the big hordes and keep your head down. Yeah. Then my brother went. Oh. Uh -huh. We were coming out of this field. We stopped to get our bearings, and one of them came out of nowhere. Must have been hiding in the bushes or something. I froze. My brother tried to bolt, and the thing just pounced on him. Tore Probably him a feral. Right in front of me. Yeah. I couldn't. Didn't help him. And then I ran. I've kept running. I guess what I'm trying to say is thanks. Dude, I just went through that earlier this episode. You can try and you still wouldn't have helped. You probably still wouldn't have been enough. All you can do is just try. And sometimes even that's not enough. car isn't going to be big enough to fit all of them. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Isn't there one in that warehouse? Isn't there still one over at that warehouse? I'm pretty sure I haven't been there. If that's the case, then I can come back and get the fucking... Finish it off! Okay. <laughs> get that stuff in there. And then we're going to be set. All right. Oh, boy. Yeah, I think I've never been over here. So the car should still be here. There's that. That was nice. Oh, fuck off. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off, Jug. Fuck off, you big fat bastard. Really? The car isn't here? Zombies up ahead. Go through or go around. Fuck! I'll have to come back for that stuff later. In the meantime, we're just gonna have to keep moving. Got to go around that juggernaut. Fuck. It was moving too fast for me. Couldn't actually hit it. Son of a bitch. Alright, let's keep moving. Stay on the main road. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off. Oh, fuck off with every single one of you. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Alright. Well. Heads up. We got zombies coming in. Yeah, I know. It's kind of hard to avoid them. They're all over the goddamn place now. Alright, he's not going to be able to get shot. There we go. Shit. Well, they, they got that one handled. Because uh, I clearly wasn't able to do a quick pot shot like I was hoping. Fuck off. Alright, screw it. Frame rate started to dip as soon as I tried to make that shot. That's fucking bullshit. I hate it when it does that. I hate it. Ugh. Fucking please, Undead Labs, promise stable frame rate in State of Decay 2. I will be happy with just fucking stable frame rate, if anything. Okay, that one was my own stupid ass fault. But the other one was frame rate issues. Don't you laugh at me. Don't you make fun of me. I'm, these are not Johns. These are not Salty Johns. You don't know. These are not Salty Johns. The first one was a fluke. The second one hit. <laughs> I'm happy. 
There we go. Ah, son of a bitch. <laughs> it's so much slower without a car. Oh, man. Son of a bitch. But the benefit is, with these guys, we'll be able to actually move over to the uh, warehouse. You know, when they open up on some innocuous scene of a guy jogging in the park, or a couple arguing about directions, and suddenly they find a dead body. Oh, yeah? Yeah. About a year ago, I go to take some trash out after the dinner shift, and there's this dog in the alley behind the restaurant, right? Okay. It's really tearing into something in this pile of trash. So I yell at it to get lost before it takes a shit. And when it takes off, guess what I see? A freaking foot, that's what. Oh, Jesus. Somebody dumped a body right behind my restaurant. <laughs> it's funny. Up until two weeks ago, that was the most exciting thing that ever happened to me. Yeah. That's morbidly exciting, but yeah, sure. It's kind of like what happened at uh <laughs> near where I live uh with the uh snow and ice, you know, piling up. Although there's not as much ice as there is snow, but someone ha somehow managed at the intersection to where there you go. my uh, road meets okay. the main highway. Uh somehow managed to lose control so badly that they spun around and their back end got indented like about a couple feet. Like, they somehow managed to drive the back end of their car into a telephone pole or something. And it just made a sharp indent like it was trying to get cut in half. That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> and it definitely was... Not something I expected to see. There we are. Reload. And we're good. Alright, let's take a look at the new faces. Yeah. Well, there's that too. Oh no, he's sick. Oh no, Edgar Nilsson. Oh my god, he's a chef. Well, I mean, brewer, but still. Oh, that's cool. He's a total lush. Well, I mean, that makes sense if he's a brewer. That's kind of to be expected. Uh, can cook. That is good. That is good. Finally, we get a cook. And we get a powerhouse. And Gabriella. Braggart, loved cycling, natural athlete, liked to travel. Body dump. This is actually good. This is a good setup. Get a new powerhouse. We get Edgar. Actually pretty good. All right. Although I don't want to move while people are sick. So we already don't need them to be sick. Uh, can we make them get better real soon? Could that be a thing we can do? Ah, oh, man. Okay, well. Um, I'm not going to be able to move for the time being. But uh, it's doable now. We have the chance and the ability to finally move. And that's good. Now I just need to go back and get that stuff. <laughs> and I can't even go and get the truck that I was using. Because I blew that up. Killing the fucking one of the jugs. Which was amazing to me. I didn't think that uh, an explosion would kill a fucking fat bastard like that. But it happened. Uh, at this point, it was a last-ditch effort. A horde of, you know, the horde of Zeds was already on me. So I just kited them around a little bit until I got to the truck and then started to mow them down. But at this point, it was starting to catch on fire, right? So at this point, I just do a fucking Hail Mary and start hitting one of the juggernauts with it just over and over. And then it finally catches, like, big flame. And I'm like, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, I need to get out of this. Ran off, and then I turn around... Because I, I don't follow the rule of cool guys don't look at explosions. I have to look at the explosion. And uh, at that point, that was when it exploded and took out the juggernaut like it was nothing. <laughs> and a, a bunch of other Zeds along with it. And it was just the biggest explosion. And I was so annoyed I wasn't able to get it on camera. <laughs> but at the same time, it was so cool to watch. Just... It was absolutely 
amazing. Alright, well, there's a car over here. I think that one's a uh, cop car. Maybe? Yeah, that's a cop car. You don't want to use a cop car. That's a broken car. I want to use that old fucking... There it is. It's got to be over there. That old classic. That's the one I wanted to use. Because then I can just leave that behind with no real qualms about it. Although, I can also use it to just move the stuff around. Because, I mean, the fast car is kind of already close to broken. But yeah, okay, we'll do that. Anyway. Yeah, I just had to explain that that was what happened because, my god. <laughs> that was cool. Whoop, okay, whoop, whoop, oh, shit. Shit, fuck, damn it. Alrighty. Drink my coffee and try to drive at the same time. Oh, wait, crashes. Whoop, whoop, ah, yeah, kind of made it. <laughs> Aha! Down the rifts to my coffee. <laughs> now I feel a lot better. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. God, I forgot the traction on these things are atrocious. Oh, boy. That wasn't great either. Whee! Well, it's not the traction per se. It's more the uh, turning radius. That's what I meant. There we are. Yeah, this thing's already well busted. I don't, I don't think I should be driving this thing anymore. Unless it's absolute emergency. I'll run this home. We'll be ready. Yeah, well. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. Okay, let's fucking kill you before you get too close. And there we go. We're good. All quiet here. Yeah. Let's get that fuel. Sit tight. I'm bringing this stuff home. We'll see you soon. Yeah, here's hoping, right? All right, and uh, get that materials. There Pulling we are. This home. Roger that. We'll be waiting. All right. Now let's get the fuck out of here. All right. Well, given the sad start to this uh, recording session, I'd say this was a actual win. When it comes to uh, actually getting stuff done. Ooh, that front end's a little bent. But not too bent, because this is steel construction. Actual steel, instead of just fiberglass and aluminum. Or, what is it the British call it? Aluminium? Because they're weird and wrong? Uh, I, I make jokes, but they're usually right. It's their language they made. I'm just American, so anything I say is right, because America... I'm an idiot. Okay. I'm almost no one should listen to me. I hope ever. You brought me something pretty. I'll show you when I get there. Yeah, it's real pretty. It used to be a pony, but then it tried to eat me, so I shot it in the face. Bring that line back! Undead labs. Like Bring that line crazy. back. Come on, really? There you go. There we go. Don't That's say what I, I never wanted. gave you anything. Sweet. Whoop. Whoop. And there we go. Sharp quick turns with the emergency brake. Alright. And let's shut that. 95. Wow, that's the highest I've ever seen it. <laughs> Alright. And we'll put that coating away. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. <sighs> so we are set for pretty much anything that the game will throw at us. And there's a lot the game can throw at us. I just want to see if there's anything I can get rid of. Who picked this up? Son of a bitch. Break that down. In a moment. Uh, nothing... 
really too substantial. Yeah. All right. Uh, you know what? I'll spread around a little axe love and give one of our neighbors one of these. Let them see the wonderfulness that is the axe. But yeah. All right. I think I'm going to end the episode here for right now because we have gotten quite a bit done. Uh, after everything that happened, we are actually well set. Ha! <laughs> our influence is 420. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm not even a pothead, but that's funny to me. Anyway, yeah, we've gotten quite a bit done, and we've rebounded from the start of the last episode to something resembling good <laughs> for this one. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments. We can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode, this has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games and finally making our way towards a decent actual setup. Because uh, Snyder Warehouse will be next after this for you. <laughs>